Yo, welcome back, everybody. It's day one, or at least 24 hours into the brand new meta. We got gameplay from some of the more broken things coming here soon. Game number one, though, has to belong to Fellbloods are just too strong. Man, the new three-star demon elemental hybrid, the thing that's basically replacing Felemental. Uh, they need to be battle cries, not death rattles, because death rattle plus three attack per turn ramps up real fast. And as long as there are mechs in the game, you always have that late game beatbox or pivot. You got mechs, you got giant minions, giant magnetics in the shop. It's an inevitability. And you have all that tempo in the middle of the game to get yourself there. Honestly, it's a match made in heaven. Demon's in, mechs in, this comp is super duper strong. All right, <laughs> enjoy. Yeah, not wrong. Ooh, can this be a free game for us? Try reloading deck tracker. I don't, I don't try to fix it actively on stream. Day one. It's going to be bugged all day. Just degrees of bugged. It's really just here for this interface and this interface for you guys. Wait, when did we get good at playing? Oh my God, we learned from Hoppa. Hoppa, we did it. Are you proud of me now? We learned how to play snake eyes and roll sixes. Yo, Felipe, I missed you a couple minutes ago. Thank you so much for the eight months. Cosine with the six months as well. Lada, Faster, Azazel, and Bab with the recent group. Thank you guys so much for the love. Over you got Hoppud. But maybe she got Beaufort. Let's let's be real. Whenever anything goes sideways in duos, it's typically both people. <laughs> both people are probably at fault. Do you like the claw? Or do you like the lullabot? I don't think we ever really go fire dancer here. Trusty pup with six health is, is kind of cute, but I would view lullabot as better than trusty pup in this scenario. That sounds dirty though. I intended it to sound dirty. The claw is the law. Okay, maybe freeze is, is fine, but we're most likely level next turn. If we get a two cost spell that's like steal a minion from the shop, we'll probably stay down for it. There's not really that much harm in freezing when you're going to level. Should have taken image not found over image not found. Nice. That seems like the play. I like the claw because of the art. You know what? Good take. Good take, actually. I'm with you there. And now the next question becomes, do you freeze the board again? Aren't Zilli X pieces really good because you can triple them more easily? You would think so. But the more people that take Zilli X pieces, the worse it gets. And we've yet to see... We've had Zilli X on our board two out of the five games, and we've yet to triple it. Okay, there was one we did, but it was turn 12. I think we've had it three times. If you don't, why freeze the first time? Because if you get the spell in the shop, that's the two-cost spell, then you stay down. Your leveling curve is really weird here. We're adapting because we're snake eyes, right? You leveled the two on turn one, which changes the, the economy very heavily. Cock. <laughs> I love this card. So good. There's that ghost we were talking about. All right. Making chicken and washing bow for life is good. Actually, I had chicken the other day. It was good. I use the leftover chicken to make homemade pizzas the next day. Unlike little garlic flatbreads. That's been what I've eaten, been eating recently. I've actually taken care of myself pretty well. Having not streamed as many hours. Gotten some sun, some daylight time. The dog's got more time out. It's starting to get warm out. Made real food. Shopped for myself. My God. I should stop streaming, honestly. Stop streaming, take care of yourself, you know? That sounds yum. It does sound yum. It was, it was yum. Okay. Actually kind of a baller hit. Are we too strong to lose? Hard to say. Stream life balance. Yeah, I mean, you should be able to, to do that life balance no matter what. I just tend to prioritize happiness 
over health when I have limited hours. Trying to keep that happiness. And realistically, the health side is probably tied pretty heavily to the happiness, and I've let that go as of late. In the last two weeks, I fixed it up pretty good, though. Or at least I think so. I really wanted to die. Maybe I'll put it up a little further. He's still on three, though. Turn five. Uh, do I really think that he's going to chew through this in these and this doesn't die? It's kind of important to get it, though. <laughs> All right. Fuck it. If we lose, we lose. Okay, maybe good read. Maybe good read, because uh, I don't think he's getting through all this. No! Yes! Woo! Card's crazy. It's really strong. See, like, that kind of tier list or whatever might mean a little more. When you're like, I can make a tier list that is, these are the most overpowered effects in the game. And then you're like, oh, when I see those, I should buy those. That's the kind of tier list I can get on board with. Like this card. Is stupid. And this card is stupid. Why is this in the game? Why is this 8-8 eight, eight stat lines? This could be a 5-5 five, five and it's still a good card. Tier lists are just too situational. Agreed. For the overarching, like, tribes or whatever. But there are some places where things like, uh, hero, hero balance, or hero in the meta is a lot more interesting, but once again, that comes down to the specific tribes that are in the game. Or like, uh, tier list per se, probably not as good, but the top 10 most overpowered cards in the meta is not clickbait, right? It might be worded like clickbait, but that's actually useful information to know. What are the top 10 cards in this meta? If you see that and you read, you read that or you listen to it or whatever, watch it, whatever media we're talking about, then you'd be more inclined to be like, oh, I've overlooked Rooster. Maybe I should be picking up Rooster on turn on Tavern 2. I didn't think this was as good as it actually is. And then when you start picking it up more often, then you start seeing the lines that, that span from that position, right? The reason to pick it up early is, is obscured compared to what it ends up being in the later portions. Obstructive sleep apnea, weight loss can cure it. I can't afford to lose weight, though. I'm tiny. But also... I don't think that was directed toward me. I don't I don't want to lose weight, chat. Stop. Why'd you kill your teammate? I first thought Elementals only got three attack, but everything, yeah, including magnetics, believe it or not. And that might be a problem. How meme is this? Do we really need that much more attack? Weak and pathetic, right? This must be done. You know what? I kinda agree. Hit like truck, soft like kitten. Yeah, it's like a kitten with fucking brass knuckles out here. Meow. Oh shit. <laughs> They have to be little tailored kitten knuckles, you know, like kitten mittens, but just much more deadly. You got to watch out for that shit. I buffed to 100 damage. Seems pretty good. Seems pretty okay. Hmm. You had to hit the goose, didn't you? Oh, Karn, now at least you hit the goose. That was pretty cool. Could be worse. Could definitely be worse. Didn't get the extra Macaw trigger, but we didn't lose the round either, so that's something. The tree.
We'll wait. I mean, I kind of have to, right? Like, there's a certain amount of embracing the meme that you just, you gotta do. Like, at a certain point, you look at the board and you're like, yeah, that, that that's gonna happen. It must be done. Going to have, like, a 400 deck Anoitron? Or, like, 35, but yeah. Yeah. We're basically the same number. Effectively the same. I mean, not half bad, considering. Oh god, it's a new tilt. Get it later? <laughs> uh, I think I'll take it. Baran. There's a second claw. Kind of hoping to hold the claw. Oh, fell blood. I mean, you know how good Rylic would be for a moment? What about a second cleave? We're magnets. Actually, kind of ass cards. We're gonna have to get get stats somehow, which is probably Bran. Two venomous cleaves at this point in the game. Yeah, you just want the space. I like the idea. I like the way you think. But your board doesn't support it. Augers. Couldn't go much better. Now that's what I'm looking for. Oh, those are shit. <laughs> On second thought, what if it's golden? <laughs> yeah, you know what? Kind of like you.
Let's cook for a second, guys. Just a second. We need to cook for a moment. We got to get creative for a moment. We got to live long enough. I can't put this in front of this, sadly. Oh, it's like the old meme of printing an entire hand worth of elementals. Well, hopefully you have enough time to play next turn, I'll tell you. This one's not going to be quick. <laughs> All right. All right. Fell blood too, sure. Oh, the Baron dying is sad. Over who's your teammate? Me. I'm my teammate. Where are you? Let's just make things a little simpler, right? We need you to level. God, we have so many resources. Certainly this isn't memes. This is definitely not memes, guys. Oh, this is so not memes. Let's try to simplify a little bit in terms of economy. Stimmy! The brains are churning. It's gone. It's going to be fine. Fluidity has gone or not. Fluidity has gone, but triple still exists. What's the magnetic Zilliax? It'd be great if you could get another Zilliax. Oh no, it's our only weakness. Divine shields and health. <laughs> and, <laughs> and just pinging us to death. Okay. A million attack is not very good when you have no, no health. we had a damage cap to work with so unfortunately no ghost somebody's got to go Seventy seconds. Get a bunch of stats on pirate. Just something.
I should do this first. Actually, no, I got the rerolls still. So good. We gotta wait. We gotta live through the turn. Can reroll for a different weekly? Oh, the weekly complaints. I saw those. Those are amusing. No. Anyway. Guys, we're cooking. Guys, we're cooking. It's so weird looking at like a million different cards. I feel like I'm playing super slow, and I am playing super slow, don't get me wrong. But like, it's not the same consideration. It's not the same cards we were looking for before. And this still exists. Beatboxer still exists. We need to get health somehow. The elemental line seems like the, the play there. So single Tethys has got to go. Any magnets? Any magnets? Any magnets? Any economy elementals? Any magnets? Can I trouble you for some magnets, please? cards that card's an elemental isn't it the new five star Typically, when you have a Golden Recycling Wraith, it's not worth cycling random elementals, but when you have Tethys, it is. Bob? Wear Magnet. I am unhappy with the things you have given me. Oh well. Guess we're in. I am unhappy with the fact that we couldn't triple there. If he's a 2020 spell in the shop, will it add the R to it? It will. So you could add a little bit of health to a minion, which just probably isn't worth spending the gold on. I am unhappy with the toys you've been given, or I've been given. Guess we'll just go beat people down with them. Madge, anyway. <laughs> All right. Doesn't look like lethal. Don't look a gift bob in the mouth. Good statement. Well, buddy, I think it's time to go. It's a magnet. It is a magnet. Better magnet. We'll have infinite gold. I guess we still take it. Once we have one magnet. This is good. Non-premium magnets.
20 seconds. Gotta choose something here. Surely this won't matter against Max. Freeze, actually. This is worth freezing. Pretty sure attack just doesn't matter. It'd be really nice to be able to play for this triple. It's just so expensive when we were dying. Over there, easy to find and easy to digest resources that list all the new cards or move cards. A few days ago, I saw you had a huge list of minions and image. Does that exist publicly? It's in Discord, actually. Yes. It is out there in Discord. Exclamation point Discord will get you a link. You just gotta like agree to the, the rules of the Discord. Don't be a dick, basically. And uh, that's it. It's there under announcements. Why are you passing on Zilliax? They're, yeah, they're not magnetic. And they're only good if you triple them. So you can make like a 200 attack minion, but do I really care? Every magnetic is a 200 attack minion. If I can get the magnetic one, It'd be worth, somewhat worthwhile. All right, 25 gold. Surely we can go find some magnets now. That's the magnetic one. Man, it's so hard to remember which what tribes all these cards are. Magnet. Ellie. Thing. I really don't give a shit. That one. 30 seconds. Oh well, is what it is. May not be Zilliax, we may not triple it. I was going to triple the magnetic and then pick it back up, you know? Would have been cool. But we don't have the gold for it. Oh well. Crimea River, we're just going to make our minions big and shit. I think 600 is probably enough. Try to pull Cleave back a little. Why not pants the Cleave guy? Yeah, you can. There's all kinds of things you can do. You got a million options, but like it's super, super early in the meta. There's like 500 new cards. You're trying to remember what each of them do. I'm just not that tied to little tiny effects like that. I would love to have a bunch of different things. There's lots of stuff that improves our board. Mm-hmm. 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 Wasn't even close. Wasn't even worried. Got 25 gold trying to play for a triple. I think has more impact than anything else. If you can get one of the triples, then you can just dupe the stat line. All the magnets in hand. Put another 600, 100. Probably would have been the, the stat line for it. Yeah. A lot of things we can do in those scenarios. Recycling Wraith is just dumb. This card is actually just nuts. It's a catalyst for, like, every board to be able to play twice as many cards. Tethys, Recycling Wraith, every comp loves it. And then we just pivoted toward mech this game because we had the big magnets and it was the easiest scaling line. Huh. Would you look at that? A W.